everybody, we're back. We just watched uh, the second episode of Stranger Things, uh, the weirdo on Maple Street, a.k.a. Eric's Middle School nick nickname. Um, no, I don't know. <laughs> I know. Come on. I like to have fun. Um, awesome. Yeah. Good. <laughs> awesome. Uh, dripping with uh, more 80s nostalgia. Yeah. There was like a little tape case thing that like just caught my eye. Just random shit like that, like a drawer like three tape. VHS version of that. I remember VHS version, but I had the tape version. It has the wood paneling, mm -hmm. everything. I love that they're, they're they're authentically nailing the 80s here, too. Mm -hmm. Like, it's not like... Macrame art in the basement. Yeah, just the, same, the right kind of carpet, the color schemes, all the wood the paneling. Yeah, the plates, the uh, mm -hmm. kind of vinyl of the kitchen chairs and all that kind of yeah. stuff. It's just really authentic, and I'm really digging that. The kids are great. Uh, Kid in the Hat, I haven't quite got all their names, but he's my favorite. Uh, the brother is really interesting. Mm -hmm. uh, we got to meet the step uh, the ex dad. Well, I guess I guess he's still the dad, but you know, what ex husband. I mean? Yeah, ex husband. Ex estranged father. Yeah, and his new girlfriend with that creepy fucking line about maybe I'll trade you in for the younger version. It's like, mm, okay, um, <laughs> that's hmm. Yeah, that's a little bit much. Um, Sheriff is still getting very interesting. Mm -hmm. The fact that they had the cook guy fake, like it looked like suicide. Yeah, well, you know, government cover up. Right. Well, I was I was worried at first that they go over there. I'm like, wouldn't they have like hidden the body and all that stuff? So it's like, ah, okay, good, good. They're doing the, mm -hmm. you know, trying to do a cover up, and they might get away with it in the '80s because the, the forensics weren't as good. Yeah. Uh, but now the the teacher found the shred of the hospital gown that mm -hmm. leads through the pipe that looks to lead to the power plant or whatever. So facility. Yeah, yeah. So that'll get interesting now that people start asking questions. Mm -hmm. um, I wonder if it's going to come into play that thing with the rock quarry where uh, they, they talked about the one guy bragging that oh, he jumped yeah. off into the water. It's that whole Chekhov's gun thing. Yeah, they, they kind of totally set that up. Um, I like that Elle has shown off her powers now, that she's a Jedi. That's mm -hmm. pretty cool. Um, God, there's so much good stuff in this one. Um, although they screwed up the horror, horror movie rules, though, I think. Well, that scene's still happening. And we don't know that they had <laughs> sex. They were starting to make out. It, it, cut away, it cut away when they started, and the episode ended pretty much. <laughs> So they, they might start with the next one and like her, they're about to and her being like changing her mind, mm -hmm. you know, so I don't know because it is definitely horror and definitely 80s vibes. By the way, love the brother because he's got awesome fucking taste in music and he's got an awesome fucking Evil Dead poster. Uh -huh. And I think he's driving <laughs> Ashley Williams' car actually, or at least uh, a very similar make and model. Meanwhile, <laughs> the, uh, God, I've got to learn these kids' names. Yeah, and, and, and I think the black kid is Spencer. Well, who's the, the Dungeon Master kid? Uh, I don't know. I know okay. Will's the missing one. L. I like so. They, like the a kid that L's staying with. Yeah. He had a dark crystal poster. Mike. Like his. Mike. Yeah, I caught that too. Mike. Yeah. Mike. Short for Michael. Yeah. There you go. All right. We're getting there. We're getting there. <laughs> <laughs> we'll get the names we're eventually. Names. Especially me. Oh, I might have been rubbing off on you. Um. Nope. Not. 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 <clears throat> and um. <laughs> If <laughs> it's still just an awesome. Would you stop thinking so loud? Uh, it's, it, I just I can't. That that's 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 it's you know it's me. <sighs> so hard being a psychic. Yeah. Um, <laughs> but um, really cool. Uh, Deb. Oh my god. Though the eightiesness <laughs> of Deb was killing me. Just the hair, the glasses. The stirrup pants. Oh, yeah, yeah, that was killing me, so. Oh, wait a minute, that's Barb. Oh, Barb, yeah, I said, I don't, I don't know why I said Deb. I, I, yeah, we, we knew she the same character. She kind of looks like a Deb. Yeah, 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 I could see that. <laughs> um, yeah, and like, she did, she was shitty at, as, as her job as, like, chaperone. Because, yeah. like, they're going in, she's like, don't let me get drunk or do anything stupid. She does everything she asked her not to let her do while Barb just sits there, like, J looking judgingly. It's like, Ugh. I mean, it's real. It's real, but it's like, ah, yeah. come on. Uh, but yeah, interesting to find out what's going on with her. Looked like a Langolier got her. Um, that's maybe some of you guys would get that reference. <laughs> <laughs> Again, they really had the Stephen King vibe, so. Yeah. Um, oh my God. Oh my God. The, there was that one moment, though, after Elle showed the kids her powers. Remember? And they were explaining what a friend was mm -hmm. and the spit promise. Oh, God. Oh my god, the kid the kid with the hat was killing us. Like even after it cut back to close up of Will and they're just in the background out of focus and he's still like Dude, seriously? <laughs> yeah, like that was I mean I don't know where they found these kids, but these kids are turning in phenomenal performances, honestly. Um so I'm I'm anxious to keep going with them. So I I started making Predictions. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> some which may already be off the table, but some may still be me good. Yeah. I'm just going along with the ride. I'm trying. I'm, I'll figure it out as the show wants me to. Yeah. 
So, uh, some of the things, because I'm just rattling off stuff as I see it. Um, like, Elle's afraid of the thunderstorm, and I don't think it's the thunder that bothers her, but so much as the massive electrical discharges from the lightning. Yeah, I think that's a good one. Uh, because whatever the monster is seems to be connected to electricity. Yeah, yeah. It's traveling um, through it, yeah. I can see that. And, uh... First, I thought since the sheriff lost his daughter about four years ago and Elle's so young, I was thinking maybe. But if my theory that it's clones, uh, then maybe it's a clone of his daughter. That could still play. <laughs> yeah. All we know, though, is she's calling the head scientist guy Papa. Papa, yeah. Or we or assume. It's... Now, they, they could be tricking us because she Papa she could to... be around the corner. That is possible. You know, I mean, that could be a film trick, so. Although it did seem like she was directing it at him. Yeah, it did. As there was nobody else. Um, right, but that is one of those things they could be just yanking our chain with. <laughs> Which made me further predict that, you know, the reason why the sheriff is popping pills and drinking so much alcohol is because he's got psychic abilities of his own that he can't deal with. Yeah, and when uh, she, she had that prediction early in the episode, I was kind of with it. I don't know that I'm behind that prediction anymore. I think because they talked about him coming from the city and, and you know, he used to be a city but, cop and all yeah. this stuff. So I don't so know if that, they're going that, 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 that one could, it could possibly be off the table at this yeah. point as well. Also, um, it looks like... Um, Dave? Will? Will? Kid? Are we Will. talking about a kid? Will. Will. Yeah, yeah. Will. Yes. Um, <laughs> don't know where Dave came from. I th Dave's not here, man. Uh, especially after um, Eleven's flipping the table up the uh, yeah, turning the upside, upside down, down to the, the black side. Put um, Will's piece in there with the monster. Which makes me think that maybe he's occupying like a... An alternate dimension. Alternate dimension, quantum spatial sort Something of Something like that, thing. yeah. So he's sort of like just slightly out of phase with the rest of existence, but mm -hmm. somehow through electronics can make his presence known. Yeah. And that's the medium that the monster is using. Yeah, yeah, it's, 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 it's getting... <sighs> I mean, we're only two episodes in, man, and it's just getting awesomer and awesomer. Uh, question. Answer. Was Will bleeding at all? Um, they didn't know. They never, they never showed that. I mean, he might have had a cut from falling down or something. Because they seem to make a huge point of... Of Deb's blood, blood in the water. Yeah. Barb. Barb's blood in the water. <laughs> I don't know why I want to keep calling her Deb. <laughs> but, I mean, um, well, she's a total Debbie Downer, but... Uh, they, mm, there you go, there you go. <laughs> Um, but yeah, really much enjoying that. Uh, the flashback to L being thrown into some kind of cage, kind of like a Faraday-esque cage. I'm yeah, not saying that's what it is, but... Yeah, something that's Mel line, probably something designed to hinder her psychic abilities. Yeah, that would be my... That's both of our guests on that. Uh, so it'd be interesting to see where that goes, man. And I'm, uh, the main villain guy the, that's not said a word yet, and I, I keep forgetting his name. But the what, silver hair. Yeah, what I'm loving about him is he reminds me of, like, David Cronenberg. <laughs> just, so I just think Actually, that's really cool. Actually, reminds me of Ted Danson. He's got a little bit of that vibe, too. <laughs> Ted Danson and David Cronenberg had a baby. Uh, but it's interesting that they found the slime, like the ectoplasm, uh -huh. when they were out there. So well, I'm the kind of excited to see where that goes. Well, the kind of almost found it. And... He got distracted, yeah. yeah. Yeah, the other cop came in. Uh, Although I think it might be emitting something that... Well, yeah, they had like their Geiger counters and stuff, too. Well, so. I mean, psychically, maybe, because it seemed like... It was like right where the sheriff should have seen it. Well, also too, it's and, kind he kind of sensed it, but he didn't really find it. Well, also too, it's probably a lot like uh, you know, like the kind of ghostly ectoplasm, like as it's traveling. You know, this monster is traveling through the uh, the planes of existence. You it know, it be. leaves leaves behind a residue. Could be. So I think that's kind of what's going on there. Um, but yeah, overall, man, like really, it's just getting really good, it just, and I got a feeling it's going to keep getting better. But uh, I think that pretty much covers this episode. Uh, yeah, I, think I mean, so. there might have been other things, but we don't need to hit every single detail. Just the things we're really excited about. <laughs> um, but yeah, so again, don't spoil past episode two for us, please. But if you want to talk anything from episode one or two, feel free to do that down in the comments. We'll have a good time geeking out with you. And of course, uh, hit that thumbs up button. Give us a thumbs up of encouragement. Subscribe if you're new here. We do all kinds of fun, nerdy, geeky stuff every single day on the Eric Butts channel. Share with your friends, because if you're cool, they're cool. We should be geeking out together. Mm. I'm sorry, that steak's coming up. Um, <laughs> and, you know, check the Patreon link. You might like it. More stuff. Support the channel. All that good stuff. And uh, let me know if you like the, the lighting scheme. I'm working on finding something that works. I feel like I need, like, I like this accent I got going on with me. I feel like I need to fix one on you. But I don't know if I can get it out of that lamp. So, I don't know. Anyways, <laughs> just a little technical tidbit. All right, guys. Well, we're definitely going to get into at least one more, right? Like yeah. 10 after 11. All right, at least one more. 
All right, <laughs> so we're gonna go do that. I'll shut up and I'll increase my likelihood. <laughs> and we will see you guys. Well, I'm saying, yeah. I'm sorry, I just got distracted by one of your pictures. Oh, oh, yeah. All right. <laughs> yeah, the, uh, the screensaver Apple TV picture thing's going on. All right, well, anyways, <laughs> we will see you guys later.